Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I am Donny Mayhem and welcome back to another legendary spotlight video from Borderlands 3. And this time we have this little beauty from Jacobs called the Flood. It is an awesome little hand cannon. Really, really fun and easy to use. It's got great damage, um, accuracy, I wouldn't pay too much attention to that. Um, it, tends, it says it's low at 42%, it's all about how you handle it. It's really easy to handle. Very, very fast reload time on this. Uh, and an insane fire rate, as you'll see in a second. So, I got this from a side quest later on in the game called Just Desserts. Now, I won't go into too many details to spoil it for you. So, as always, I will put the clip at the end of this video showing me obtaining this from the mini boss in that who dropped it for me. Uh, obviously, I'm not sure because I've only found it the once whether he drops it every time or whether I just got lucky. Chances are I just got lucky, but there you go. After I show you a bit of gameplay footage of this gun, if you don't want to see any details of that side mission, I suggest you turn off. Anyway, with that being said, let's show you a little bit of gameplay footage with this little beast. I think we've got a few skags around here. So it fires very rapidly, and as with most Jacobs, you hit the critical spots, you melt enemies. Um, as you see, I mean, that's a big badass skag and if you hit the crits with this it puts ammo back into its clip it fires really fast it's really easy to handle as you can see and it reloads insanely quickly it's a little beauty so that is the flood once you get to that side mission i highly recommend you find this gun um, it's one of the easier weapons to handle from jacobs that i've found it's really cool smart looking Good damage on it and easy to handle. Okay, right, so as I said, up next I'll show you the footage of me obtaining the weapon. If you don't want to see it, switch off now. But thank you for watching. Hit that like, hit that subscribe for more Borderlands 3 and gaming content, and I'll catch you next time.